All right, just so you guys know, I did start another YouTube channel. It was called MCT Two Minute Reviews. Go over to the channel, check it out. It's gonna be a good one. It's all gonna be like two minute or less videos and hope to see you guys there. All right, you guys, today what we're gonna do is we're gonna test out the 12 volt, five amp hour DeWalt battery. For those of you that know me, I love 12 volt tools. It is my favorite line of tools just because the power that they have with the size and what they actually are. And so, yeah, so I did notice through my videos, I've been straying against 12 volt, which I need to do more 12 volt tools. What we're gonna do is we're gonna try a couple of tests for each tool. We are gonna try the DCF801 impact driver. We're gonna also try the DCF601 screwdriver. And we're also gonna try the DCD701 drill driver. Now, in a, I'm gonna save the 12 volt extreme recip saw in a, for another video, but this video, we're gonna test these three tools out. We're gonna do one three amp hour battery. We're gonna do the, another five amp hour battery. Besides duration, we are gonna see if you actually get a little bit more power out of the cells. Since there's more cells inside, they will share the load. So you get a little bit more power that's already there because the batteries are less strained. Let's see what happens. I'm excited about this one. Just so you guys know, out of the 12 volt tools, the screwdrivers is my favorite tool. Sorry, I have the, I have the brushless Hilti, DeWalt, and Makita. I still have to do a brawl against those, and I still need to get the Milwaukee uh, brushless fuel screwdriver. So I love both of these. I love both of these equally. This type of tool is my favorite tool. We're all, that's why we're only doing one test each across a couple of tests, because I don't want to strain, I don't want the batteries to be depleted too much. Battery is still full. The battery is still full for the five amp hour obviously. All right, so let's uh, test out the screwdriver. All right, it is on max. Right here is good. All right, so ready? Go. You can do it. You can do it. Oh, it's okay. That's expected. Uh, this is a variable trigger only, no speed selection. All right, so this is actually a good test. Let's, all right, so that is where the DeWalt, uh, the three amp hour stopped. Let's see if the five amp hour could drive it in all the way. Do it right here. All right, so ready, go. Ooh, holy, that's a result. That's a result right there. All right, now let's see if the five amp hour battery could finish this one. All right, so ready, go. Bam, right there, you guys. If you guys, for those of you who say there is no difference in power between amped, uh, amp, uh, a different amp hour battery, there you go. There you go, not too shabby. So that oh, we just proved that this five amp hour battery majorly helps out your DeWalt 12 volt extreme tools. Seriously, this is a bad man pajama and I cannot wait. I cannot wait to do uh, versus videos against uh, Milwaukee, DeWalt, Hilti, Makita, and Bosch. All right, so let's see if the 12, uh, three amp hour could take it, take it out. All right, ready? Go. It can. time all right let's take out the five amp hours this battery is i love it i love it all right ready go oh yeah a lot faster that did that a lot faster all right so next that i i had no idea that i was actually going to do that no idea all right, just so you guys know, this is just a simple test. We are gonna get more into detail about this battery. I just wanna get the feel of it, see how it acts and see, uh, do tests that I know it can do. Battery is full. All right, so, ready, go.
time. Now I am seriously curious on how well the, the five amp hour battery would do. Uh, the battery is full for the five amp hour battery. That does look cool. I, I like the way that looks. It does make the tool look beefier too. All right, ready? Go. Oh yeah. Time. It, I do hear the difference in the motor, but uh, the, t uh, the time will tell. That's why I put the timer on because the timer lets us know what the tool did within a tenth of a second. So it helps out a lot. All right, so let's take this out. Ready? Go. Time. God, I love 12 volt tools. I got to do more 12 volt tool videos, you guys. I do. All right, let's take the five amp hour out. All right, so ready? Go. Time. I don't know if there's a time difference, but you could definitely tell there is a different sound in the motor. God, and these Milwaukee gloves suck. We have our Daredevil Bosch uh, self-driving spade bores. Sorry, uh, spade bits. Let's try a one inch, we'll try a one inch. The reason why I love self-driving sp uh, spade bits and tests, because they require no pressure. This uh, feeds itself in and you just pull the trigger and just hang on. God, that battery, that battery's insane. That, that's extremely good. I cannot wait. I cannot wait to get the, uh, the half inch impact wrench. At least that, the half inch version. All right, uh, we have it on. We have it on drill. Battery is still full. All right, let's try it right here. You know, with this, we might need to switch to speed one. It is on speed two. If we need to switch to speed one, then so be it. It's a 12 volt tool, you guys. All right, so that's uh, right here is good. All right, so ready, go. All right, speed one for this is required. We're uh, obviously. So let's go over here. All right, speed one, speed one. All right, ready, go. Time, it did it, it did it. All right, so we are gonna go to speed two. All right, so we are gonna see if we could finish this hole that, uh, the three amp hour started. All right, ready? Go. Wow. Aww. All right, now we're gonna try the entire thing on speed two. Remember, it's a one inch spade bit, not bad for a 12 volt tool. All right, ready? Go. It stops, but it's able to. It's able to. Now let's go back to the three amp hour. Right here. All right, ready? Go. Having major, and it has a, and it has a little little help. All right, one more, one more time, over here. All right, ready? Go. Nope, it's having trouble. Having trouble. All right, let's whip out the five amp hour one more time. We're gonna finish this. I expect one pull of the trigger for this to be uh, finished. Ah, it's through. Or right, not bad though. It does. This battery does improve the motor. All right, so let's go to speed one. Let's time this. Right here is good. All right, ready? Go. Time. This, this battery is seriously awesome. Now, that is the point. I'll just let you guys know that is the point of me doing these tests and getting these tools and batteries to... So you don't have to buy this to find out if this actually will help you out. 
So by me doing this video, you are you now know what to expect from this. So this battery will help your 12 volt tools out be, to last longer uh, when it comes to the duration of the battery, and it'll give your uh, tool the more uh, more power to the tool with the cells that are already there. So that's pretty much it, you guys. Uh, I'm going to be doing a lot of versus videos with this among the other brands. I was super excited to get this. I will be getting the half inch. 400 foot pound impact wrench the extreme and so I, I can't wait to get that this battery does look cool it does so that's pretty much it, you guys i hope you found this video helpful and entertaining please like this video please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos and please subscribe to the channel this is dave nicholas thank you for tuning in i'll see you guys next time